Now to Southfield police investigating a serious crash involving a school bus. Six people, five kids, one adult injured. And our crews saw parents rushing to the area, of course, trying to make sure their kids were okay. Seven Action News reporter Faraz Javid with the latest. I'm on the corner of 12 Mile and Greenfield, where just before 8 this morning, a head-on collision took place between a school bus and a car. There were three people, including two children, inside the Chevy Cruze, while the bus was carrying around 33 students from Crescent Academy, less than a mile from the accident location. Everybody was, like, scared. I imagine my mom heard about it. She was scared, too. This boy was one of the kids on the bus. His mom arrived right away after she got the scary call from her son. My first thought was, are you okay? You know, is everybody okay on the bus? I, I could hear a little bit of screaming and crying in the background, but yeah, I'm like, turn around, I'm on my way to work, you know? So I'm like, let me turn around and go get my baby. So like, I was just sleeping, and like, all of a sudden I just hear like the windshield, like, crack, and like, I hear something crash, and like, I wake up and my head started Six people were taken to the hospital for non-life-threatening injuries, including one adult and five kids. Southfield Fire Chief Johnny Menefee says they are all in stable condition, and the kids were taken to the hospital as a precaution. Very dramatic morning here in Southfield on the corner here, but, you know, it's a constant reminder, right, to, to make sure that um, you're watching out for everybody, that you're obeying traffic signs, and that everyone's going to be safe. Southfield police and fire departments responded and additional rescue units were called from Birmingham. I'm a little nervous and I'm like worried about if he's okay. You know, I don't want him to, you know, be his head to hurt later. So I'm probably just going to take him home and make sure he's okay. Now I reached out to Crescent Academy, but they didn't want to share any comments at this time. Meanwhile, Southfield Police Department says they're still investigating the crash. In Southfield, I'm Faraz Javed, 7 Action News. Pros, thank you.